What is ELF? Initially launched as a testnet in August 2018, ELF is a blockchain-based, customizable platform operating system intended to serve as the central hub for blockchains. The ELF team designed the platform to act as the Linux system of blockchains. Since the introduction of Bitcoin, blockchain technology has evolved in profound ways. Bitcoin made the concept of a decentralized and peer-to-peer -peer currency mainstream and disrupted the finance industry forever. Then came Ethereum, which expanded on that idea with the introduction of smart contracts and decentralized applications, unleashing the potential of blockchain beyond internet money. Dozens of industries are now experimenting with blockchain and looking to optimize their processes. But there remains a chasm between blockchain and the business world that is not easy to bridge. The ELF team believes that the next phase of blockchain should be an integration of these two worlds. For that to happen, however, there has to be an operating system designed for blockchains that will allow them to meet commercial needs. And for that to happen, blockchain needs to deal with three main challenges. The scalability challenge. The current blockchains are not equipped to handle enterprise-level transactions. Lack of resources segregation. The current blockchains do not segregate resources for various smart contracts, resulting in interference in their execution. Lack of a predefined consensus protocol allowing for the smooth integration of updates or the adoption of new technology. ELF proposes to solve these problems. The ELF team. ELF is the brainchild of Mahaobo, who is also the founder CEO of Blockchain as a service company Hoopox, and the CTO of Jimpay and Alcoin. Founder and CEO of TechCrunch with Michael Arrington and FGB Capital Zhu Shaoji, serving as advisors. It's worth noting the venture capital support that the project received. Companies like Draper Dragon, Bitmain, Haobi Global, DHVC, Blockchain Ventures, Chain Funder, FGB Capital, and other notable investment firms participated in the ECO. Indeed, the project proved so popular that they had to turn down interested investors after hitting their 55.000 goal just two weeks after the sale began. This testifies to the potential of ELF. How does ELF work? To address the three problems we previously mentioned, ELF employs two major innovations. Sidechains, chains. A unique governance system. The platform utilizes side chain technology to segregate resources among various smart contracts, and a delegated proof-of-stake consensus algorithm to achieve a more dynamic system of governance. Side chains. ELF features one main chain and a multitude of side chains to handle various commercial tasks. The main chain is responsible for distributing different tasks to the multi-layer side chains, improving efficiency. Side chains communicate with the main chain via a side chain index system. The index system categorizes the chains as follows. External blockchain systems to expand the boundary of ELF such as Bitcoin and Ethereum. Internal side chains on the ELF ecosystem, which contribute economically to it using the ELF token. The side chains can branch off further into subchains. Dividing the ecosystem into side chains ensures that downtime or failure in one part does not affect the entire network. ELF's token ecosystem. The ELF token incentivizes honest behavior within the ecosystem. All side chains accept ELF as a store of value and as a means of transferring value. Hence, the token can be transferred across any chain that recognizes it as, as such. When a side chain receives transaction fees, it has to give a fraction of this revenue to the miners on the main chain. If the main chain finds that indexing a side chain is not economically favorable, it is entitled to terminate the indexing or allow two side chains to offer the same services to compete. 
Side chains can also charge fees to their subchains. What is the ELF consensus protocol? The running and maintenance of ELF are more complicated than that of Bitcoin and Ethereum blockchains, because ELFs involves recording information from various side chains on the main chain. Plus, miners must update information from all the parallel side chains. As such, Proof of work and basic proof of stake consensus algorithms will not suffice. Instead, ELF employs delegated proof of stake to run the network more efficiently and ensure the predictability of block formation, which enhances user experience. The process is as follows Dash holders of the ELF token vote on who will become the mining nodes. Then the elected nodes decide how to distribute mining rewards among the rest of the nodes, plus stakeholders. This equation determines the number of miners. Miners equals 2n plus 1, with n starting at 8 and increasing by 1 every year. Just like in other blockchains, mining nodes are responsible for relaying and verifying transactions, packaging blocks, and transferring information. How are ELF tokens distributed? ELF held its pre-sale in December 2017. The distribution of the 1 billion tokens was as follows. 25% went to investors. 25% went to the ELF Foundation, a three-year vesting period. 16% went to the ELF Team, a two-year vesting period. 12% went to the marketing and airdrops. 12% went to mining over a 100-year period. 10% went to advisors and partnerships, a 2-year vesting period. What is ELF's market standing? As of May 30, 2020, ELF is trading at $0.092932, while ranking at number 105. It has a market cap of $50.599,793, a 24-hour volume of $24,971,816, a circulating supply of 544,480, 200, a total supply of 880, 000, 000, and a maximum supply of 1. 000, 000, 000, 000, 000, 000, 000, 000, 000. Elf's all time high was $2.77, and its all time low was $0.035013. Where to buy Elf? Elf is traded on several major exchanges, including Huobi, Binance, CoinSwitch, Comtry, KuCoin, YoBitnet, and IDEX. Most of the platforms require you to exchange such cryptos as BTC, ETH, or used for ELF. This means you will have first to purchase any of the proxy coins with fiat. ELF also has a reward system known as Candy. Through this system, you get to earn points that you can convert for ELF by carrying out simple tasks such as interacting with ELF tweets, inviting more users into the ELF Telegram channel among other promotional activities. However, a quick check online reveals the Candy program does not seem to be active currently. ELF supports a web wallet, but recently introduced beta versions of both Android and iOS wallet apps. However, you can use a third-party compatible wallet such as Ledger, Keepkey, Exodus, Coronomi, Terzer, and my other wallet. Conclusion ELF is a relatively young project, but still holds a ton of potential. The enthusiasm displayed by big-time venture financiers is a testament to how big it could become, and its implications for the blockchain and business spaces. Its strategy to separate resources through side chains and a unique governance model should help propel it to significant heights, both as a blockchain project and as a business model.